If you'd like to slice up shapes and paths in Affinity, it's super easy to do, and we can use the knife tool. Now, if you don't see this, it's usually hiding underneath the pencil tool, and the shortcut for this is K on the keyboard. Now, in Illustrator, you have the knife tool and the scissors tool. Affinity combines these into one, which is lush. So let's go and select this shape, press K, which is the shortcut for the knife tool, and we can click and drag like this, and it quite literally will slice off the top. Or what we can do with the knife tool is click and drag holding shift and make horizontal or vertical cuts. There we go. But something else we can also do, if we select the bottom bit, and we're going to set the fill to none, so let's press forward slash on the keyboard. There we go, nice little shortcut for you. Again, we're going to press K for the knife tool, and then we can hover along the path, and you can see the icon changes to some scissors. Now, if you can't see this icon change, it's because my screen recorder's being a bit weird. And then what we can do is just click anywhere to make a cut. And then if I press A for the node tool, what we can do is drag these out. And you can see these pieces of path have quite literally become separated. So yeah, whether it's slicing up shapes or making cuts in paths, the knife tool in Affinity is the one you want to use.